This is a picture that was taken um, at the uh, Sydney University of the energy levels, uh, the energy dynamics around uh, carbon atoms, uh, molecules. And so here we see the same vorticular, you know, dynamics of uh, the space-time torque, according to my views. And we'll get into very high scales level. Uh, this, is, uh, this is surveys that were done of superclusters of galaxies that's extremely large. Um, and when they looked that far, they expected that things would be quite chaotic and not organized and so on. And instead, they found the exact contrary. These very large scale structure organizes in octahedrons and um, and tetrahedrons array way out there, uh, and these papers are actually uh, published in, in literature and called a uh, fractal or egg carton universe and stuff like that. That's what they're seeing out there, and basically it's just like this. If you've got your nose in the rug, if you've got the, your nose in a Persian rug, there's no way you're going to think that there's a pattern to it. You're just going to think it's all chaotic. But if you get far enough from it, if you, get, if you change your scale relationship, all of a sudden you start to see the pattern appear. And that is what I believe we're starting to see is the actual structure of space-time and how it organized matter.